Hi, it's Buck Moore and... Oh, hang on a sec. Hey there, it's Buck from Bacon Trees and thanks for dropping by. Um, I'm gonna go through how to put together a good breakout kit for your live sound and audio visual adventures. So I have several breakout kits. One is a breakout cable and connector kit with some tools in it, which I'll go through. And then I've got some special microphones and measuring devices, which I use for uh, different shows, depending on depending on the situation. I almost always bring this. This is the most important thing I have, which includes a multimeter, so I can check electricity, I can check batteries, I can check cables with the impedance meter or the ohm meter. I've got a battery tester simply for testing batteries. A mini jack to RCA connector kit. Uh, but this one is, is a female mini jack to male RCA, but I also have a connector. So if I want to connect uh, PC audio or, or, you know, smartphone audio, I can do that with this uh, TRS. So it's a TRS jack, not a TRRS, which is different, of course. If I want the RCA plugs to go into a mixing board, I have to put quarter inch connectors on it. So quarter inch to RCA connectors or RCA to quarter inch so I can go into a mixing board. You need the flexibility of having the quarter inch to RCA. I've got plenty of these too because there's lots of different possibilities for connections. Mini jack to RCA to quarter inch. I have a small precision screwdriver set. I've got actually two of them because the handles on these are bigger and the handles on these are smaller. So in some situations, the handle gets in the way of small intricate fittings that I have to adjust like microphone cables or uh, speak on cables, or there's various situations where you might need either or. This is an impedance transformer. So my impedance transformer is going to convert high impedance to low impedance or low impedance to high impedance. So I, it's, probably made for singers that want to put their vocals through a guitar pedal. I'm sure that's why this thing was made. Correct me if I'm wrong. But I go from line output, so I can do mic input into a PA system at a conference center or other sound system, and I need a barrel jack. I need an XLR female, uh, male to male, XLR male to male to be able to do that. That's a close-up of the XLR, male to male. I have to connect it like that, take the line output out of my mixing board and go into a mic level input of a mixing board or a ceiling PA system or something like that. I've got a female to female turnaround. This XLR, female to female, very handy just in case. I've got a tip ring sleeve mini jack to quarter inch left and right because I could use quarter inch cables to make the same sort of uh, headphone output connection from a smartphone or a, uh, a computer. I've got this thing which has saved me many times. You never know when you're gonna need it, but it's a simple XLR splitter. So I split a microphone into two channels or I split an output into two different sources. And I've used it for a microphone going into a video camera which needed two inputs but only had one microphone and one mic cable, so I was able to split this into two different microphone channels into two different levels, one is for backup, or I'm able to take a microphone input onto a mixing board and split this into two different channel strips so I could have two different individual controls. It depends on the situation. There's no one situation, there's many possibilities here. RCA to RCA stereo female for turnaround. RCA mono to RCA mono female turnaround. Quarter inch to RCA connector. Quarter inch to quarter inch turnaround. And just about any combination of turnarounds you can think of to turn one gender of cable into another gender of cable or connector. I've got various different sizes of DVI and uh, Mac output display. There's a few of those to VGA. So I've got primarily VGA connections going into my uh, audiovisual setups. 
So they're all VGA, but they all have different ends on them. Just about any connector you can think of. RCA to RCA female, RCA female to quarter inch, quarter inch to XLR, and then TRS quarter inch headphone jack. And that's pretty much it for my breakout kit. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe and I'll give you more. Thank you.